Hey YouTubers, and welcome to another episode of the Samurai Monkey 42. I'm dedicating this video to a famous swordsmith during World War II by the name of Emura. Emura is one of my favorite swordsmiths at the time. He was the director of the Okayama prison during World War II, and he taught prisoners there how to make swords to support the effort of the war he wasn't a master swordsmith but he did this more like a hobby and what you see here it's a great example of an emura sword and this sword is in great condition I wanted to dedicate this video to show the his a little bit about Amura, which is one of my favorite swordsmiths at the time. This sword it's in bent condition. You can see the wrapping is in great condition. The Gold plated material is great and it comes with the lieutenant tassel. So I have this sword open now. Let's take a look at the blade. You can find a lot of Emura swords. And they all have different craftsmanship levels. As I mentioned before, uh, Imura show prisoners at the Yokoyama prison to make swords. So they all have different levels of craftsmanship. And I'm trying to zoom in. And on this sword, you can see the famous Imura. Koji temper line which almost looks straight but as you get closer you can see the little circles so this is a beautiful example of his work In a moment, I will be showing you guys the signature. When it comes to Japanese swords and the temper line, you got to find the right angle to appreciate the temper line. Um, you can see the burnishing. It's just beautiful. The dark and all this lacquer here, and they brighten up the temper line. It's a beautiful example of the Amura's way of making sore at the Okayama prison. And I also mentioned that this is one of my favorite swordsmiths at the time just because is that one person that wasn't a master but they wanted to learn and did this as a hobby and ended up making just beautiful swords um, a lot of high-ranking officers surrender swords that were made by Amora as I mentioned earlier in the video there was a general that surrendered a Amora sword Okay, so now I took off the handle of the sword, and this is the signature of the famous Emura Chunsai Emura.
to sort its its dot date it so there's no um, date on this side only the sort maker which is Emura Chunzai. Well, that's the end of this video. Uh, thank you so much for watching this video again. If you want to share, like, subscribe, and check out my eBay store, I would appreciate that. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.